we're visiting past families, um, past relatives' family farm and resort. There are 250 mango trees. They um, ripen and harvest in the spring and he started exporting last year. But it's um, not only a farm, also a resort. There are 12 rooms here, a um, swimming pool. And if I can get there without hurting myself on this dried ground, I can maybe show you the swing. Oh, no, not, not real well. Through the trees, there's a little play park. I'm going to back up a little because this was really good and I was reluctant to ask if I could interrupt the conversation by um, getting up and taking pictures but we're walking on our way to lunch now and so I felt like I could ask A walk takes a long time because there's so much chatter on the way but here's a little kiddie playground it's so sweet just slides and swings and teeter totters seesaws I'll show you a couple of rooms but I'm not sure that I want to go as far as walking back to where we were sitting I'll see I'm trying not to keep everybody waiting And I'm sorry I'm crunching on the gravel here. This is just really lovely. Here are two of the rooms. They each have this little comfortable swing outside. Um, just garden everywhere. And it's just beautiful. I'll try and get the area where we were sitting before we leave. Because it's another minute's walk out there. But look at these plants. Tim said, plants like this might cost $60, $75 to buy one at home. And then they said, you can take any you want. And of course we can't. We can't bring those in, but aren't they lovely? I'm hoping that this will show up. The sun's in a bad position, but right by the gate on each side of these gorgeous, gorgeous trees. I guess they're trees, they look like um, the trunks are big enough to be called trees. They're all in bloom, they're lovely. So this is a water tank and there's a little water in the bottom because of course this is dry season, but look how big it is. It's just enormous. <laughs> And then they've got um, pipes pump up to here. Wow, <laughs> these are back. Picnic tables um, works well if you just sit cross-legged. And we've made it back around to the area we were sitting. So let me show you these trees. We were just sitting here on the swing, under the trees, sitting on the benches. And it's cool here because of the cover. It's so nice. It was just really enjoyable. In a minute we're going into this area to eat. Um, they were chasing a lizard out earlier. Well, we've stopped at a roadside stand to get some chai. Some of us are getting some chai. I had a couple at our lunch with uh, friends. Um, I wanted to show you this, this little wash basin there. About everywhere we go has a wash basin and people will typically wash their hands before they eat and after they eat 
They don't use napkins particularly, although they always have them to give us if we want any. Over here, he's working on getting the juice out of mangoes and it's really, really loud. They do always have um, napkins if we ask for them and they will use them themselves, but that is not clean enough for them, I think. So everywhere, everywhere we go, they'll wash hands before they eat and after they eat. And they probably think it's a little strange that we don't. I typically, they eat a lot with their fingers. I think that's the difference. I'm used to eating with a knife and fork and so don't feel the need to wash my hands if they're not dirty and then I'll use a napkin if I need to wipe anything off my hands. But um, because they've used their fingers, they're sticky and messy and need to wash afterwards. And certainly I've done it, but that's not a practice of mine. It's been an interesting, eye-opening practice. We're learning to play cricket. I think I may be in danger. Whoops! <laughs> oh, he's out first time. <laughs> the chair is our wicket. Don't show this much your thumb. You should cover it. Okay. Oh, nice one. We've recruited the driver to help. This was a He's good at hitting. This is a tennis ball, not a cricket ball, but. the end of our ball. <laughs> I have to get out of the way. I'm really impressed at how, how well Tim hits the ball. <laughs> I think Tim is playing baseball. <laughs> <laughs> 